Whether you pre-order Diablo 4 or not, you actually get access to the open beta which is starting on March 24th with access running until March 27th. But Diablo 4 has tailored their editions of the game very precisely so you want to make sure you don't buy the wrong version because one of them is a game changer. If you could leave a like on this video it helps a ton but turn that into a dislike if you do get to the end and you did not enjoy the video. I've rounded these prices up by just a penny so let's simplify them so you have the standard edition at 70 bucks and if you specifically pre-order the standard edition besides the base game you actually get the following cosmetic items you get the inario wings and inario's murloc pet in diablo 3 on top of that, you also get the Amalgam of Rage Mount in World of Warcraft and the Umber Winged Darkness cosmetic sets in Diablo Immortal. And yes, we all do have our opinions on that game. Also, worth noting, when you do pre-order the digital version of this game, you will not be receiving the actual physical copy. So, just worth noting if you are someone that, well, prefers the hard copy of the game. Next up is the Deluxe Edition at 90 bucks, And this one is the one that's in between the cheapest and the most expensive technically excluding the collectors but it's the one that's a complete game changer you get everything that you do in the standard edition but on top of that the deluxe edition also unlocks diablo 4 seasonal battle pass and allows you access to the full game up to four days prior to its actual release now a lot of people do very much feel 50 50 on this because of course arguably you can have a pretty strong advantage on well most other players because you practically have almost almost a week early access so I personally prefer it when people do just get the game when it drops without any major early access I guess you could say sure typically you can get 72 hour early access etc but four days is a bit heavy in my opinion but again if you want to raise the bar by practically give or take 20 bucks then it is probably worth it on top of that you do get the temptation mount in diablo 4 and you get the hellborn carapace mount armor in diablo 4 now the last one at 100 bucks is the ultimate edition and not only is it only available digitally through battle.net and playstation or microsoft store but you actually get everything you get in the previous editions except it allows you to skip 20 tiers in the battle pass and you do get the exclusive wings of the creator emote in diablo 4. now personally if I have to be brutally honest with you, I don't see the huge advantage with the $100 version. However, with that being said, the Deluxe Edition, in my opinion, is the go-to as realistically, it has a lot more benefits in terms of the way you go about things in the game. But that's my take. I want to know which edition you're going to be getting and what you're going to be playing on. So let me know in the comment section below and also which class you're going to choose. Let me know in the comment section below.